So, inside of Brawl Stars is a mode called Ranked, which is a competitive mode for players to play and climb the ranks. But, in today's video, I'll be talking about the worst brawlers to use for Ranked. So, without further ado, let's dive right into it. Alright, so let's firstly kick it off with the fifth worst brawler to use for Ranked, and that is Daryl. Daryl is a poor brawler inside of Ranked due to him being so outclassed in these modifiers and none of them are really tailored to his specifics as a brawler. He's not really an ideal brawler for any scenario and he doesn't pose as a counter pick to any brawlers. Many brawlers can end up countering him because the brawlers possibly have certain advantages over Daryl, especially in the timed detonation modifier, as that mode is catered towards sharpshooters that can easily outrange him. Therefore, this is why Daryl is a poor brawler in ranked. Alright, next up we have Bali. So as you may know, Bali himself is rarely picked in ranked, mainly because of how vulnerable he can be against enemy brawlers, and there are other throwers who can do significantly better than him, such as Grom, Sprout, etc. With his overall kit, I don't think he could have the ability to save himself in sticky situations, due to him not being able to deal enough damage and with his super it can be easily dodged so yes there's not really much to say other than how vulnerable he is and this is why barley is poor in ranked let's now move on to the third worst brawler and that is doug with his buff everyone expected to see a great deal of potential with doug but however it still hasn't impacted him too significantly he is still countered easily because he struggles to push up and be able to deal damage because especially with high DPS or burst damage brawlers, he'll struggle to stay alive, meaning that he also relies on his super to help him change the tides of the game. And like many of these brawlers, the modifiers aren't catered towards him. So yes, generally he is far too weak and not a great pick to use inside of ranked, Therefore, this is why Doug is horrible in Ranked. Moving on to the second worst brawler to play inside of Ranked, and that is Hank. So, Hank is far too easily countered. He's honestly an F tier brawler, and will stay an F tier brawler until he gets buffed. With his main attack, he charges up a balloon, and the bigger it is, the more damage he deals. Unlike Angelo, though, his charge doesn't last forever, and that makes it difficult for Hank to take control of the game, especially if he gets his attack cancelled mid-charge. He has to spend all that time to recharge the balloon, if that is so. Even in sticky situations regarding close combat, he wouldn't be able to kill them fast enough due to the little damage he can deal, and plus, consuming your time trying to charge up your bubble to deal slightly more damage before he dies won't help him regardless. Therefore, this is why Hank sucks in ranked. Let's finally move on to the worst brawler by far. And yes, it is no explanation. It is Frank. This is literally self-explanatory, but yes, Frank is appalling inside of ranked due to his overall build and his vulnerability. So, many brawlers are able to counter Frank and his shots are so easy to evade. When you attack with him, you stop in one position and then the attack registers. So, this just makes it really difficult for Frank to be able to farm his super and it makes it harder for Frank to be able to take control of the game. Furthermore, with the added perspective that none of these modifiers are catered to his needs, hence, he also can't thrive inside of ranked matches. Even with Frank Super, it becomes highly predictable due to the extended activation time, allowing enemies to easily evade his super, resulting in potential wastage. Anyways, this is why Frank is by far the worst brawl to play in ranked. Alrighty everyone, so I hope you enjoyed today's video. Be sure to also let me know down in the comments below what your rank is currently right now and what rank you hope to achieve someday in the future. Be sure to like and subscribe and if you want to as well, share my videos. Also join my Discord server below in the description and um, see you guys later. See ya.